one Pyrex jug of cold water to help speed up the process a little. It's five to eight. I've got to drive to Candidno and I'm catching a bus to Liverpool at 20 par 25 minutes past nine. Not sure where the bus uh, sets off from, so I'm gonna have to look that up soon. Don't wanna miss it. That's it, I'll be on a bus. I'm driving to Candidno. <laughs> Stay tuned. Uh, the roads are freaking deadly. I, I've gone sideways once, but nothing I couldn't manage. Just, yeah. Oh, fuck. There's some cars trapped over there. I didn't bother with the Fat Jack's breakfast because I needed to find somewhere to park the car for free for the day and I need to find out where this bus stop is, so I didn't want to chance it. This is Venue Cymru, I think it's behind Venue Cymru. I'm gonna have to Google it in a minute and make sure. Oh, this way. I'm confused. Your destination is on the left. There, then. Is that it? Coach. Oh, fucking hell. I'm not entirely convinced I'm in the right place. Pickup place. I'm sure I'm not the only one catching it. Obviously, I'm the only one here now because I've still got like 45 minutes. So I'm gonna go to Starbucks, which is just there, and grab an eggnog latte because obviously I am. Oh, wait. Breakfast? That's not open, is it? Nah, it's not open. Got 15 minutes for the bus. That coffee might have been a bad idea. I need the toilet now and I'm about to go on a bus for two hours. Ugh, what am I doing? That was stupid. Rookie move. Not used to catching buses. That might be it already. Oh wait, maybe it's there then. We learn something new every day, don't we? sit quietly and read from the nutritional bible which has only been taken out twice here it's very gray and sleety i was hoping for more snow if it was good if it was going to be this crap of a weather i was hoping at least for snow i am starving that journey took uh just over two hours for three pound fifty it was a seven pound return i'm not complaining but it was cold at the back of the bus like my feet are freezing. And there was these like teens sat around me. Quite a few of them uh, were not well. Like coughing, coughing and sneezing. So if I get a cold or something in the next week, I wouldn't be surprised at all. I think I actually needed my woolen hat today. It is freezing. And that's the last time I'm gonna say it's cold.
I thought I'd get my mum a Bob Marley t-shirt, but they don't seem to have any small here. They're all like medium, large, extra large. Wait, Soho's is still going? <laughs> the one in Chester shut years ago. Well, it's definitely changed. Ah, I see, they just hide all the goth stuff upstairs now. <sighs> oh my god. I haven't worn jeans like this since like 2013 maybe, the latest? I used to have quite a few pairs of these. They got a well in here. Yeah. And people drop money, you know, like there's a crack there, I guess. Bold Street Coffee, that's a different building, isn't it, I think? But they used to have, like, uh, vinyls, like, playing. Good place, nice coffee, too. I think they moved buildings. There we are, Free State Kitchens. I promised myself I'd come back here if I was in Liverpool, so... Here I am. I, play, I passed some good food places, but... I think I'll have a special guest beer. If I don't like the sound of that, I'll just have a pint of the Freedom Pale Ale. Oh my god, this is not making it easy to choose. Christmas festive burger, chicken, uh, pigs in blankets, oh my god, and I've got chicken wings as well to come, so it's going to be expensive, but that's why I worked Friday. Not really. Just trying to get it all in. <laughs> I'm going to enjoy the hell out of this. I can't record it because, yeah, there's no such thing as stealth filming in here. I have to dip one in the gravy. Oh, so good. Got hot chicken wings. With blue cheese sauce. Whew. It snowed the entire time I was in there. The floor is like all sleety. I spent forty pounds and oh wait a minute, forty pounds and thirty-five pence. That's a pretty cool t-shirt. like a bar. Photo booth? Yeah, it's a bowling alley. Well, I'm here on my own. So there's no point going bowling. Oh, I stumbled across the fucking HMV, lad. Fucking HMV. This has to be from the 90s, right? The 90s movie? <laughs> oh my god, it is. Should I buy it? That's crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> I 
That's exactly what a lying burger would say. That it was honest. Before it breaks your heart. I got about half an hour to the bus. I'm not far from the uh, bus station. It's just over there somewhere. <laughs> okay, that was one. <laughs> Trying to keep your beers cold. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping his beers cold. It's a good place to do it, I guess. That water's freezing. So judging by this, National Express is in stands one and two. So that's literally there. 25 minutes past six, I'm back in Candidno, almost out of the car. Whew, that coach back was boiling. The coach there was freezing and the coach back was boiling. But for six quid plus um, one pound fee, ticket fee or whatever, seven quid, for a return, I'm not complaining. Right, almost at the car. Gonna go to co-op, get a drink of water because I am parched. That's the vlog, bye. And now before I sit back, relax, and order this Ring of Honor pay-per-view, a quick quote from the Nutritional Bible. Just kidding.